Hey everybody, welcome to another Free Tip Friday. Uh, Daniel here, thank you very much for joining me. It's a very special Friday because this is the Friday before Memorial Day. So if a family member, friend, brother or sister, whether brother and sister in arms or some sort of familial tie, gave their life for the country, it's a good time to reflect on that sacrifice and how it shaped our personal freedoms today. So that aside, it's been a really great week for business. Things are starting to turn back on. The economy is turning back on. Customers are starting to show back up and it's a beautiful thing. I will say this, I've said it a couple times on social media and just to emphasize this because we're starting to hit a drop dead date. Um, the world has changed and competition is starting to catch up. So I will say this, you are in a position and your brain is in a position where if you act now and you still pivot correctly, uh, you could steal a tremendous amount of market share from your competition. You could shape the future of your organization for the next five years. And you're starting to come to a point where it, it's not going to work anymore because your competition is caught up. You're like two or three weeks away from being able to really influence things. So if you haven't transformed into digital marketing or you haven't adjusted your sales strategy, you got about two or three more weeks left. You probably have till first week of June, end of first week of June, before frankly the noise floor of what's happening on digital social media, digital marketing is so high that it, it you're lost, right? So uh, if you have questions about that, put it in the comments below. Visit us at josephstudios.net forward slash community and we'll have a conversation about it um, or reach out to me directly. It's, it's something that could set you up for the future. And I'll say this before we move on. Uh, 2008 was the starting point for a lot of millionaires. It wasn't the ending point for a lot of millionaires. Uh, if you focus on the positive, you can look at the past to kind of predict the future. And today we're coming out of this disaster and you could be in a position where you're setting yourself up for a tremendous amount of success. So definitely something to look into. Today for Free Tip Friday, we're focusing on how to do exactly that digital social media. Um, how do you uh, connect with people? How do you influence people? What's effective? And I'm going to give one quick tip for you, and that's that you should be actively participating in conversations. We here at Joseph Studios help from a uh, scale perspective, right? So it's very easy to have a personal relationship and build a personal relationship with one person. We can help you do it at scale and one way to do that is to actively participate. Treat social media as if it's a big house party. You know, show up, wear something nice, drink in your hand, smile on your face, work the room, participate in conversations. That's what we're gonna focus on here today is participating in conversations specifically on LinkedIn. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna share my screen real quick and we're gonna go through an example. Here you can see as it pops up, we have a group on LinkedIn. Groups are great places to work with folks and learn from folks and reach out and build relationships and connections. Uh, here we have WWD, Women's Wear Daily, and it showcases itself as the fashion Bible. Um, it has almost 74,000 members and it's a great place, likely from a B2B perspective, to meet uh, new contacts. Here's the catch though. Uh, a lot of what happens on LinkedIn, and I don't like this at all, is just shouting in an empty room. In this case, it's a room with a lot of people, but a lot of shouting going on, not a lot of answering those shouts, not a lot of active participation. So here we see Mary Lou, uh, she's posting, Marguerite, she's posting, Alexandria, she's posting, uh, Mary Lou again, Dory, Leanne, Jan, a bunch of folks are posting in here, right? But no one's actually replying. And isn't that a shame? No one's liking, no one's commenting. No likes, no comments. No likes, no comments. All the way back up. So essentially a lot of people are trying to build relationships and no one is saying, yeah, that's cool. I read this article, it's great. I really like your thoughts. What do you think about this other thing? No one's doing that. And this is a great place to exactly make that happen. Um, so what I would recommend is find people like Mary Lou on these groups and build friendships, build relationships with them, read what they have to say, comment on it in a meaningful and intelligent way. And doing this, you're going to build up your, your following. You're going to potentially have new friendships, new partnerships, new businesses, uh, all sorts of great and wonderful things, right? New leads, new deals. So that's the free tip. It's pretty simple. I wish it, didn't have to be said, but especially on LinkedIn, there's a lot of shouting, not a lot of good conversation. Uh, 
And I highly recommend that you participate in those conversations. So uh, that's the free tip. Uh, I recommend it for people in more of a B2B perspective. Uh, if you're a uh, business owner, if you're a sales rep, uh, I think this would be particularly of interest, but find groups that pertain to your target customers, join those groups, actively participate. Don't just post, reply, like, comment, share, all that stuff. It's beautiful. Now, that's the free tip Friday for today. Again, if you have any questions, feel free to put it in the comments down below. Uh, visit us, josephstudios.net forward slash community. Please do subscribe if you liked this video so that we can continue to produce produce more videos like it. Um, and if you need me for anything whatsoever, just email info at josephstudios.net. Myself or a team member will be happy to answer your questions. I hope you have a fantastic, reflective, uh, and meaningful Memorial Day weekend, and we'll see you next week. Bye for now, guys.